Hi guys, it's Mike Davia. Welcome to my channel. For this new video, we will be react. Yay! <laughs> Hi guys, it's Mike Dave. Welcome to my channel, and we are going to react the worst uh, rice cooking show ever. <laughs> I saw that one on Facebook, and we'll be doing the same. We'll be reacting to that horrendous um, <laughs> cooking. We Filipinos know know how to cook rice. It's very easy, but for this video, this is going to be excruciating and really, really stupid. So, let's start. But before that, guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below, and click the notification bell and set it to all so you get the latest updates from me. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, to my channel sister. <laughs> to my channel sister. So, don't forget to channel to my subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my uh, sister sh uh, sister sh bleh, sister's channel here, Kitty Pun. Yay! So let's start. So by the way, guys, this is a full video of BBC Food. So we we'll, we will be cutting this to the. Mo the most yeah, whatever a uh, part of this video of cooking rice okay let's start egg fried rice don't be afraid this is really simple it's cheap it's delicious really satisfying and it's like a takeaway but you haven't paid eight quid for it so a lot of people get afraid of cooking with rice but you can follow a really simple rule which is for every one part rice you have you need two parts water it's as simple as that well guys in the here in the show it's just different uh we do cups or a yeah basel <laughs> i know it's a, a glass it's not literally glass but it's like a cup or plastic cup and then we measure it by two or how many times do we measure it three yeah three because we are in a big family and so that method of uh one cup of rice then another one or two cups of water yeah it, yeah sure but the, here it's different we just have to um put it in a caldero <laughs> i know it's english is that <laughs> then once uh then the faucet then suppose this is the what uh, rice then the water uh, slowly goes up then we have to measure it yeah, here yeah here yeah, yeah, you touch the rice a bit, and the water is here, then that's okay. It honestly does work every single time. This is going to cook enough rice for around two people. So now the rice is on, it's time to... My bing, 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 bing. So now we need to simmer. Look halfway. Once it's on the simmer, you want to cook it for around 10 minutes. You don't have to open the... You just leave it there until it... Uh, the water has uh, what do you call this? Uh, the water has been absorbed. By yeah, by so the rice, some of turned to steam. There's no wa water left, very little water left, and then you just have to you know, preheat it, just a little bit of heat. Okay, rice. We are looking good. How, how can you say it's looking good? <laughs> it should be. Um, there should be no more water there. Okay, now this is stupid. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and why is she strain it? <laughs> you have to drain it. You just have to leave it there. Quite a lot of starch in it, which will make it a bit. What? <laughs> Not the rice. The rice is soaking wet now. <laughs> no. It's, 
it's not how it should be. If you get a cup of rice, put it in a caldero, what you call that? What, whatsoever how you cook it or in a rice cooker. And then, um, before cooking it, be sure to rinse it well because there is some starch. <laughs> so there is some starch to it. So you have to clean it. Yeah, have to clean it. But for us, we have to yeah, wash our hands thoroughly. And then, ah, here's my grandma. Hi! So, you have to wash it thoroughly, uh, thoroughly, the rice, before cooking. Once the water comes out clean, that's the time you have to um, pour, pour some water there from the faucet and until, just like we said, um, to this part here. Yeah, yeah, here. Very little. Yeah, very little. And that's it. Now, this lady here is stupid. The, the rice is not soaking wet. The, the, the rice is soaking wet. It's like a porridge. Yeah. Then why do you have to strain it? She's all wrong. <laughs> so you're stir frying it. So rinse it, and that will just keep the rice nice and light and fluffy. Right, time to chop the veg. So yeah, guys, that's time the part of cook. cooking rice, the very, very wrong way. And. For Japanese, they'll be using a rice cooker, most of them. Here in the Philippines, most of us won't use electricity because it, it's expensive to cook on electricity. So, instead of using electricity or rice cooker, uh, we use a stovetop. But, there are those living in boarding houses, living alone, students, and also for condos, for safety, they'll be using electricity. But, most of us living, uh, with our family, we'll be, we are usually uh, we are using stovetops. We are using gas, and that's how we cook rice. For her side, it's actually wrong. Why do you have the like she cook it and yeah, then... she cook it. She didn't even rinse it at first. <laughs> she she rinsed it, put it in a strain like a pancit canton. <laughs> on after it's been um. It's, uh, I don't <laughs> um, once uh, from the part of the video, it should be you know, when it's still wet, it's still boiling a bit. You should start um, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, mix. yeah, mix it a bit because we don't want the bottom part of the rice to be burnt, and so we mix it a bit. So once it's mixed, just um. Turn the heat down to as low as much as possible just to preheat it. I don't know, preheat or just give it a little bit of warmth until the steam uh, or water inside has fully evaporated or absorbed by the rice. And that's how you actually cook rice. But this woman here, right here? Oh! <laughs> so that's all, guys. And don't forget what I said subscribe. Down below at the side, there's a notification bell to get the latest from me. Click all, like, share, and comment down below. And bye-bye!